What it do, it's your boy Drew Blue back at it again for another first time reaction. Today, what I got in action for y'all is a new track that um, Young Trip just hit me up. He did a song with Melly X titled Beast. Um, in case this is your first time seeing this or checking out Young Trip's music, he's um, he's a cool ass homie. Only about, I think, 14 or 15 years old, give or take. My apologies if I got your age wrong, but he's here based in LA. So support the young homie and, um, you know, give him the opportunity to shine. You know what I mean? So check out his music if you like what you hear. Dude's got mad bars. He loves to rap. And at the end of the day, he's all about, you know, just spitting what's on his mind. So I'm going to check this out see how I feel about this song. But let me tell you something, man. You really want to hear some hard bars, go check out his channel. Uh, and you'll definitely rock with what he's got. All right, with that being said, let me get into it, man. You already know the drill. We'll cut the chat, get in the track, and bye-bye. To Young Trip, featuring Melly X, Beast. Let's get it. Oh, nice visual, homie. I like that. Say to anyone, young trip, don't take, don't take it personal, because at the end of the day, you do what you do and you rock with what music you want to rock with. But I hate this beat. I'm a producer. I produce my own shit. So to me, I'm very, very strict with my 808s, man. To me, that shit gotta vibrate. I hate when pe when people turn that 808 into a kick. It's the worst pattern. It's basic as fuck. But at the end of the day, man. Fuck that. I liked your performance. That shit was funny as hell. <laughs> Feeling like I'm Asian with that shit. I like that. The energy you came in with this was dope. To me, it definitely, um, bro, it just flourishes here. You know what I mean? Despite the fact that I think the beat is whack, I definitely like your performance. I like the way you came in and did your thing, you know. Look, you got a special energy, homie, so you just keep doing your thing. To me, man, I mean, like, I'll say this, man. Fuck the industry. Whatever, like, if you can get your hand on some crazy beat, some beat that sounds unique or different, you know, don't 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 settle for beats like this. Settle for something that's more unique, that you feel like can match your energy. Cause you got something else, bro. Like the way you come in on this song, it they don't feel boring at all. Like even when I can't stand this beat, I'm listening to you. I'm rocking with it. So like, yeah, that's what I'm saying, dog. I say invest your time into, you know, selecting the right production for you, bro. I know how you want to blow up. And trust me, bro, when you are really, really hungry to get that, you're going to take whatever you can to get there. But at the same time, don't be afraid to build it up, bro. Like, don't be afraid to build your foundation built on something that you want to rock with. Um, but, yeah, like, uh, at the end of the day, I know when it comes to you, when you jump on the mic, you got it. Like I said, bro, you got talent. And don't, don't let the distinction... Of who you is, whatever, like, like, don't ever let that get you down. Like I said, I met, I had a warehouse, warehouse worker, homie, who 
stopped rapping and a dude could freestyle off the dome but he said he's like nah i'm not doing it because everyone thinks i'm gonna do cholo rapper because i'm hispanic and all that like don't ever let anything like small like that block you from going what you got to do so like i said man um dude you're too talented don't worry about the these industry beats don't worry about these industry things like you you can find your own style your own sounds bro just keep just take your time to research through it because bro ain't no ain't no lie you got the fucking talent just find the sounds that complements your style your style and rock with it you know what i mean because i think <laughs> you got energy homie i like it so that's all i gotta say um no i definitely enjoyed this but like everyone i'm dead serious if you're watching this check out this homie he he doesn't make beats like he doesn't go on beats like this normally he's got songs where he just goes in and raps crazy man uh I'm gonna go back and play this again. Damn, I can't find it. Shit, I can't find it. Damn. Oh, yeah, what's this track right here? I like this shit right here. But to me, when he comes in with this Studio Shine Radio. They say I'm rapping about random this shit, but I'm snapping. So your bitch is saying I'm popping like popping like rapping. Like I said, random this shit, but I'm snapping. So your he, bitch is you need a funky beat like, like this. You need a beat like this that just comes in. And like I said, it sets the mood straight. It's like, no fuck niggas allowed. Like, if you ain't got talent. So that's just a little refresher for anyone that hasn't really checked out my other video. You know what you remind me of, bro? You remind me of Travis Scott when he first started coming up, man. He had a unique flow like that. He was unique sounding. He had that energy. To me, I think that's the best route. Like, kind of study Travis Scott. You know what I mean? That's my advice to you, young Ship. Like, study, like, Travis Scott's, like, before Rodeo, man. Like, how he was doing it. How he did his crazy shit. Like, get on some crazy beat, man. You know what? Fuck it. Get something where, like, your 808s are going crazy. You got the hat hats rolling like, like a motherfucker something. You don't know, you know? Unless you go out and experiment and find your different sounds, dog. Because at the end of the day, when you find what fits you, that's when you can take that shit, bro, and just roll straight ahead like a fucking, you know, um, locomotive, man, and be like nonstop, man. But yeah. Hey, this was fun, though. Um, but like I said, I like that verse, though. That verse on that, um, on that song was definitely clean. On Beast, I rock with it. But yeah, this is your boy, True Blue, signing out. Y'all stay safe, stay blessed, and... Yeah, show Young Trip some love, man. Definitely a cat who's got a lot of potential, and he's just scratching the surface, man. And he's only 14. Keep that in mind. All right, deuces.